Y listo. Wednesday, December 16, 2020. Ayúdeme, Ariana. Today is. Ariana. Today is. December. 16. Wednesday. 16. 16. 2020. 16. 2020. 2020. Yeah, you say Wednesday. Wednesday, December. December 16th, 2020. O también 20. 20, no hay problema, 20 o 20 es igual. En, en Gran Bretaña usted dice 2020. En América, Estados Unidos, 2020. ¿Le entiende? Eh, Ismael, today is... Present, eh, Wednesday, December... Eh, 16th. Eh, 16th, 2020. Yeah, uh, I told you uh, the number 16 as cardinal number. You say 16, 16. As ordinal number, you say 16. La punta de la lengua sacamos entre diente superior e inferior y pronunciamos el TH, ¿no? 16. Así se pronuncia, así debe ser eh, pronunciado, ¿no? Eh, Ismael, ya está. William. William. Present. Today is. Wednesday, December. 16. Ok, 20. Keila. Siga, siga. Wednesday. Wednesday, December 16, 2020. Ok, 2020. Bien. Eh, permítame un ratito, Keila. Ya, ya, Keila. Eh, luego dice. Eh, va a escuchar primeramente. Dice: Check with tips Rosie agrees to. Which Tips, dice, which tips? Filling the blanks with words or expressions. From the audio, there may be more than one possible answer. El ejercicio más complicado son estos, el escuchar y completar. Vamos a, a practicar. Escuche, listen, and let's try to complete. Ponga toda la atención posible, por favor. Le veo que está haciendo otras cosas ahí. Concéntrese, por favor. Rosie. You seem down in the dumps today. What's up? If Justin and I were still together, today would have been our anniversary. You guys only dated for a month. You shouldn't be feeling blue. You should make yourself feel cheerful instead. How? To start, do something about your appearance. You've been wearing sloppy lounge clothes constantly since the breakup. I'm too sick at heart to bother looking stunning again. Whatever. How about starting a fitness routine? Getting your heart rate up will lift your mood. I don't like anything physical. If I'm already down in the mouth, why would I make myself more miserable? Fine. Then buy yourself flowers. The bright colors and lovely scents could work. Well, carnations are in season, and they are my favorite. Listen to lively music, too. Nothing will raise those low spirits faster than a catchy pop song. Sounds good. I'm obsessed with that genre of music anyway. You also need to have fun. You haven't wanted to come out lately. You're right. I promise to show up next time. Uh, when you have this kind of... Rosie, you when you seem have, down in the dumps today. When you have this kind of exercise, uh, what is advisable, listen to this first and the second time. And then you try to complete the answer. Or the opposite. Lee usted primero las preguntas o en este, caso, en este caso las frases, and then you listen to it, and then you complete. Entonces, vamos a leer qué debe completar. Eh, William ya dijo, Maite, five steps to lift your, no sabemos qué, siga por favor, exercise, you. Maite. Exercise, you may feel to, to run on the treadmill of Light weights, but if you help you be depression right at the under. Yeah, you say treadmill, la rueda de andar, no? Create, siga, niña, Maite, create. Create an atmosphere, breathing up your living space, can breathe up your life. Yeah, create atmosphere. 
brightening up your living space can brighten up your life. Brighten up, alumbrar, aclarar, no? Your living space can brighten up your life. Siga. Put on some. Put on some during listening to pop music will help you to step in in no time. Aha, put on some tunes. Listening to pop music, escuchar música pop, will have your toes tapping in no time. Eh, dar golpecitos con el pie, los deditos de los pies, dice, no, en el piso, ya. Yeah. Eh, siga, make yourself. Make yourself look discarded all of you outfits. Eh, outfits, los trajes, no, la ropa sería. Make yourself look discard all of your outfits. Eh, siga, go. Your party friends can break you up whenever you are. Yeah, friends can bring up, sus amigos le pueden alegrar, dice, no, bring up, bring you up whenever you are. Bueno, entonces, escuche nuevamente, esté atento porque yo le pregunto indistintamente, ¿no? Vamos desde el último ahora. Listen to this again and listen to the question, the teacher's question. You seem down in the dumps today. What's up? If Justin and I were still together, today would have been our anniversary. You guys only dated for a month. You shouldn't be feeling blue. You should make yourself feel cheerful instead. How? To start, do something about your appearance. You've been wearing sloppy lounge clothes constantly since the breakup. I'm too sick at heart to bother looking stunning again. Whatever. How about starting a fitness routine? Getting your heart rate up will lift your mood. I don't like anything physical. If I'm already down in the mouth, why would I make myself more miserable? Fine. Then buy yourself flowers. The bright colors and lovely scents could work. Well, carnations are in season, and they are my favorite. Listen to lively music, too. Nothing will raise those low spirits faster than a catchy pop song. Sounds good. I'm obsessed with that genre of music anyway. You also need to have fun. You haven't wanted to come out lately. You're right. I promise to show up next time. Listos? What is the word exercise? You may feel too... to run on the tread, treadmill of leaf waves, but it will help you beat depression. ¿Qué palabra debemos completar ahí? Escuche, por favor. Rosie, you seem down in the dumps today. What's up? Yeah. Uh, Viliana Sebastián, what's her name? What's the woman's name? Escuche. Rosie, you seem down in the dumps today. Okay, what's the name of the girl? Uh, Rosie. Yeah, what happens with Rosie? Is she, is she happy or, or she's sad? Escuche. Rosie, you seem down in the dumps today. What's up? Is she happy or is she sad? Uh, happy. Escuche. Rosie, you seem down in the dumps today. What's up? You, you see, you see down or you feel down. You seem down in the dumps. Just you seem down. down. Exacto. Ayer recordará las expresiones. Teníamos en su librito, en la página 70 y, permítame, abra su librito, por favor. 71 es, o 72. 72. Yeah. Ahí tiene, 72, feeling down. Entonces dice, why do you feel or do you look down or do you, yeah, do you seem down, dice, escuche. Póngale atención. Rosie, you seem down in the dumps today. What's up? If Justin and I were still together, today would have been our anniversary. You guys only dated for a month. Yeah. Uh, did she have a boyfriend? Okay, Mr. Villena, vamos con Alison. Alison. Did she, did Rose have a boyfriend? Alison, Valdivieso. Si no me contesta, a pesar de que esté el nombre ahí, yo le, tiene falta, ¿no? Daniela, Daniela. Present. Escuche. Today would have been our anniversary. You guys only dated for a month. Did Rose have a boyfriend? Did Rose have a boyfriend or Rose has a boyfriend? 
Rose has a boyfriend. Rose has a boyfriend or Rose had a boyfriend? Escuche. We're still together. Today would have been our anniversary. You guys only dated for a month. You shouldn't be feeling blue. You should make yourself feel cheerful instead. Yeah. Did she have or does she have? Does she have? Does she have? Y la pregunta es, did she have a boyfriend? Yes, she did. Does she have a boyfriend? Yes, she, yes, she does. Escuche. Did she have a boyfriend? Yes, she did. Oh, no, she did. Ahora, does she have a boyfriend? Yes, she does. Oh, no, she doesn't. Pero el compañerito nos dijo que ella estaba triste. Ella está triste ahorita, ¿no? Entonces, mi pregunta es, did she have a boyfriend? Yes, she did or no, she, did, or she didn't. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. She had a boyfriend. Ella tuvo el novio. Entonces, ¿cuál es la idea hipotética que ella dice? Escuche. If Justin and I were still together, today would have been our anniversary. Today we would have, we would have dinner. Mire, today we would have dinner. Lo hipotético es, we would have dinner. Cuando usted tiene la, el auxiliar would, ¿sí? W-O-U-L-D, would. Está hablando en forma hipotética. Entonces, we would have our anniversary. Tendrían, un, tendrían o celebrarían el aniversario, ¿no es cierto? Pero, ¿qué le dice la amiga? Escuche. If Justin and I were still together, today would have been our anniversary. You guys only dated for a month. Ya. Yeah. Eh, niña Daniela, mi pregunta es, how long was her date? How long was your date? One month, two months, or three months? One month. Yes, only one month. Imagínese, ¿no? Eh, solo un mesecito de, 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 del enamorado que ha tenido, ¿no? Y ya está sufriendo ella, ¿no? Imagínese un año. Terrible, ¿no? Entonces, escuche. Our anniversary. You guys only dated for a month. You shouldn't be feeling blue. You should make yourself feel cheerful instead. What she advise? ¿Qué le recomienda? What she advise? What does she advise? ¿Qué recomienda la amiga? Daniela, what does her friend advise? Advice um, es recomendar, aconsejar. Escuche. Shouldn't be feeling blue. You should make yourself feel cheerful instead. Ya. Yeah. Make yourself. Yeah, eh, cheer yourself, le dice, ¿no? Cheer yourself. Alégrate tú misma, le dice. Cheer yourself. ¿Qué le diría usted a la amiga en esa situación? ¿Qué le diría usted, Daniela? Que, que se anime. Decir, que salga. Que salga, ¿no es cierto? Get out. Have a date. Look for new friends. Go to the park. Go to a dance. Go to a party. ¿Qué más le puede decir? Mm. Eat, ¿no es cierto? A ver, ¿cómo? Que se despeje, que salga a caminar, que Eso. coma bien. Take a walk, eh, have a good, have good lunch, or maybe a, a eat your favorite dish, ¿no es cierto? Eat your favorite dish, que, como usted dice, ¿no? Eh, se prepare su favorito comida sería, ¿no? A milkshake, por ejemplo. O... Oh, eh, que se vaya a un restaurante, ¿no es cierto? Bueno, puede ser, ¿no? Pero ella implica dinero. Ok. Y bien, Daniela, vamos con Jennifer Singaña. Jennifer. Present. Luego dice, escuche. For a month. You shouldn't be feeling blue. You should make yourself feel cheerful instead. How? To start, do something about your appearance. You've been wearing sloppy lounge clothes constantly since the breakup. I'm too sick at heart to bother looking stunning again. Whatever. Yeah. What is the first advice? Uh, Daniela me decía, go to a restaurant, um, uh, take a walk, or go walking, alguna de esas, ¿no? Pero la amiga le dice algo. ¿Qué le dice sobre la vestimenta? Um, que se pone un vestido azul, creo. Ya, yeah, bueno. Eh, ellas, eh, la, eh, Rose, me, de pronto viste... Eh, digamos, eh, 
ropa, digamos, de clase de los 80, los 90, de pronto, ¿no? Entonces, que, que cambie el look, le dice, ¿no es cierto? Mire, escuche. I'm too sick at heart to bother looking stunning again. Whatever. How about starting a fitness routine? Lounge clothes constantly. Ahí está. You've been wearing sloppy lounge clothes constantly since the breakup. I'm too sick at heart to bother looking stunning again. Yeah, maybe she was wearing long dress, long skirts, uh, old blouses, and uh, and color clothes. No, black and white, gray, nothing else. Entonces le dice, try to change your clothes. Le dice. Luego, ¿qué más le, le, qué, qué le aconseja? ¿En qué área le aconseja? Whatever. How about starting a fitness routine? Yeah. Eh, Jennifer, what is the other advice? Um, fitness routine. Yeah, en vez de fitness routine sería go to the... The gym. Eh, go to the gym. Entonces usted mire, escuchó una cosita y usted le interpreta y dice, no, pues go to the gym. Do exercises. Go to the park. Si usted ha visto en el parque, ahí han puesto estos ejercicios, ¿cómo se dice? Estos ejercicios, eh, perdón un ratito, estos ejercicios, ay, permítame un ratito. Ya, yeah. estos ejercicios, por ejemplo, de, de los parques, de, son a manera de escalera china o o también son unas eh, rueditas, sí, para hacer ejercicios también como, como gulumbios son, ¿no? Entonces puedes ejercitarse ahí también, ¿no? He visto acá, por ejemplo, atrás de, de Solanda, hay estos ejercicios también. En los parques en general, son nuevos estos aparatos, ¿no? Entonces usted dijo, go to the gym, punto, go to the gym. Listo, Jennifer. Dylan Ruiz, Dylan. Yes, teacher. Ya, yeah, escuche. Getting your heart rate up will lift your mood. I don't like anything physical. If I... Yeah, mi pregunta. Does Rose like these kind of exercises? Escuche. About starting a fitness routine. No. Getting she... your heart rate up will lift your mood. Escuche. I don't like anything physical. Ajá. Ella dice, I don't like this uh, physical exercise. ¿Qué dice usted? Yes, she does or no she doesn't? No, she doesn't. Ya, yeah, la pregunta. Does she like this kind of exercise? No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Para nada. Luego dice. Nicole, if I'm already down in the mouth, why would I make myself more miserable? Fine. Then buy yourself flowers. The bright colors and lovely scents could work. Yeah, what is the third advice, uh, Richard? What is the third advice? Escuche. Then buy yourself flowers. Ya. Yeah. ¿Qué le aconseja? Buy chocolates. Flowers. Ah, buy flowers. flowers. Correcto. Buy flowers. Y le dice the, the smell, ¿no? The smell of the flowers, maybe, can help. Conditions are in season, and they are my favorite. Listen to lively music, too. No. Y la otra es, ¿cuál es la otra, el otro consejo? Escuche, por favor. And they are my favorite. Listen to lively music too. Nothing will raise those low spirits faster than a catchy pop song. Sounds good. Yeah. What is the idea? ¿Qué le aconseja? Escuche. Listen to lively music too. Nothing will raise those low spirits faster than a catchy pop song. Yeah. Eh, Richard. Ah, es que pensé que era, eh, listen music. to, to music. Eh, listen to music. Tal segunda idea, ¿no? Daniela también nos dijo algo de respecto, ¿no? Listen to music. Correcto. Listen to music. Listo, Alison. Ya, yeah, entonces vamos a completar. Primera, number one. Complete, por favor. Low spirits. Ha sido low spirits. Página 73. Low spirits. Complete. Five steps to lift your low spirits. Cinco pasos para levantar su espíritu. 
caído su espíritu, su, su bajón, ¿no? Su, su depresión, su tristeza. Exercise. Create a, no sabemos, put on some, make, you, make yourself look and go parties. Ahí tiene las cinco, los cinco pasos. Póngalos en práctica, por favor. Si usted ha tenido una, una digamos, un, una desilusión por ahí, póngase duro, póngase pilas, ¿no es cierto? Vamos entonces. Reynoso Fabricio. ¿No está? Fabricio. Ok, Fabrizio, complete por favor. Exercise, you may feel too. Ahí está, mire, you may feel too. Down in the dumps, complete una de estas. Blue, eh, sick or heart, down in the mouth, cualquiera de esas, ¿no? You may feel too down in the dumps. You may feel too blue, you may feel too sick or heart. You may feel too down in the mouth. Cualquiera de esas, ¿no? To turn on, perdón. To run on the treadmill or leave waves. Pero sí le va a ayudar, dice, ¿no? But it will help you beat depression. Si usted, el joven, si usted tuvo alguna desilusión, vaya al gimnasio. Se olvida, en tres días ya está pilas ahí. Dylan Pérez. Dylan. Dylan. Eh, Fernando Pazmiño. Fernando. Eh, Alison Ocaña. Listen, listen. Así está Pazmiño. A ver, Pazmiño. Eh. Siga, la, la tres. Create. 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 A more shopper. A ch cheerful. A more shopper. Siga, brightening up. Brightening, brightening and breaking, breaking up. Your living space can be meant of your life. Okay. Cheerful atmosphere. Cheerful atmosphere. Brightening up your life. Your living space can brighten up your life. Sí, mire, crear una atmósfera que, que le aliente, ¿no? Alegre, feliz, dice. Claro. Ahora sí, Alison. Ocaña. Ok, Alison. Eh, la siguiente. Put on. Put on. Put on some living cat. She eh, turns listening to pop music. We'll have your toes tapping in no time. ¿Qué le parece esta Alison? ¿Qué hace usted cuando... Está deprimida. Bueno, en el caso de que esté deprimida. A ver, ¿qué sabe hacer? What do you do? Eh, nada. No, nada. Una comida especial, tal vez, ¿no? Un dulce, ¿no? No, es que se me pasa enseguida. Ah, bueno, mejor. Eso, eso entonces, usted está muy bien, mire. En cambio, el profe sabe coger su parlante de mil watts de potencia. Pone ahí unas canciones... 10 sobre 10 y listo. No, no, mentira, digo nomás, no, no. Igual, no hay que ser fuerte, ¿no? No hay que dejarse sobrellevar esas situaciones, ¿no? Muy bien, Alison, hay que ser fuerte. Vamos con Keila. Keila. Present. Eh, make yourself. Make yourself look stunning, discard all of your. All of your sloppy. Sloppy outfit. Correcto. Make yourself look stunning. Discard all of your sloppy outfits. Todas las tristezas, dice. Los trajes tristes, dice ahí. Y eh, usted mismo, Keila. Go. Go. Go party, friends. Can bring you up whenever you're losing at her down in the mouth, down in the dumps. Yeah. So you have to choose one of them. You are blue, one. You are sick of heart. The second, you are down in the mouth, the third, and you are down in the dumps, the four. No, one, two, three, four. Yeah. And Rosie, you seem down in the dumps today. And mire, ahí tiene los vistos. You have the checks. Yeah, there are five steps you leave uh, the low spirit. But Rose, or uh, Rose friends, advise create a cheerful atmosphere, put on some lively catchy tunes, and go parties. No. Listo, veamos el diálogo ahora sí a continuación. Ahí tiene, mire. 
Rosie and Jill ha sido la amiga, ¿no? Rosie and Jill. ¿Listo? Veamos si se ha cargado las notas antes de irnos. Permítame descompartir. No sé si es que está cargado. Sí, sí está cargado. Ahí, ahí le comparto, por favor, rapidito antes de... Bueno, permítame un ratito. Primero suspendamos esto.